Every college student, under-resourced or not, one of their primary fears is looking stupid. Looking stupid to faculty and staff, looking stupid to their peers. So they don't ask questions, and then they make big mistakes. So I've been using an interactive text messaging platform to give students little nudges about important dates and things that they need to attend to. And it really works. I'll send out an email, uh, a little text message about the FAFSA form, and I'll get back a whole bunch of questions about this and that and the other thing, completely unrelated. But the students are in that tyranny of the moment. They need the information right now, and I can send it right back to them, and their problem solved. And they didn't look stupid. We also need to realize that our students are leaving behind a lot of their bonding social capital. So everything that we can do, especially early in the semester, to try to help them make relationships with other students who are like them is fantastic. And so those are things that we can do in the classroom and in the dormitories, the places where the students are going to see each other again and again so that they can continue the conversation and build a real friendship. So activities, group projects, anything you can do that gets them talking, you can step out of the way, they'll take it from there. And the third thing to realize is that many of our students don't realize that we are here for them. They we have to do, take every chance we can to make explicit the idea that we are bridging social capital for them and we can help them. And the more often that we do that, they'll start to believe it and they'll come to you and ask for help with resumes and contacts in the community, the kinds of things they need to get ahead. So just in time text messaging to solve the problems of the day, bonding social capital with students who are on the same journey that they're on, and bridging social capital with faculty and staff on campus or some things that might help you build, use the driving force of relationships to help your students achieve in college.